Hey everyone, what's up? This is Vignesha from Gizbot and in today's video, we have come up with the 5 features of Google Maps that you should know. Let's go ahead. It is possible to use the Google Maps offline when you need to scope out a route or figure out uh, bad you are when you have no Wi-Fi or any internet connections. So in order to to make the map offline you need to go to the google map maps or uh, app on your mobile phone and just tap the three vertical bars on the top left corner when you tap it you can see the offline areas option just tap on the offline areas option as well um, in the option areas page as you can see here uh, just tap on the custom area it will leave you with a small box where you can download a specific area to put into an offline mode so as of now i am uh, uh, downloading the map of bengaluru in offline mode uh, before downloading it just make sure that your mobile is connected to your wi-fi uh, rather than your mobile data and once you are set with the place you can just enter the you can just tap the download option here so as you can see the downloading the downloading of the offline uh, maps is in progress once the offline map is downloaded you can uh, search the route wherever you want within the downloaded uh, areas so as of now as you can see i'm just turning on the wi-fi and uh, here i'm searching uh, for the route uh, to mg nagar from jayanagar which is our area so as you can see in offline mode the map is working so that's how you make an offline map as well like other options the google map also has the options to share your location uh, so in order to do that all you need to do is to just hold on to the blue dot as you can see here till the pin drops down on the specific location which you want to share once the pin is dropped on the map uh, on your desired location all you need to do is just tap on the address bar on the bottom of the screen as you can see and uh, tap on the share button once you tap on it uh, it will ask you or it will leave you with lots of options including messenger whatsapp hangout etc and etc so you can select the contact on the desired app you want in case if you want uh, to share it via messenger you can do it just by tapping on the messenger or whatsapp you can do it uh, and just select the contact and send you can always tilt your map and get an isometric view on google maps tap and hold on to the map with the two fingers slightly apart and then swipe up move your fingers in a circular motion will rotate the map if you make sure that you are in the normal view with the satellite and terrain turned off there are certain areas where google has added 3d representations of the building you probably use Google Maps on both desktop as well as your Android phone. If so, there is no need to start over when you are switching from Android to PC or PC to Android. So all you need to do is just go here on the Google Maps and search for the location you need. Once it shows the desired location, uh, you can share it on your phone just by move, heading on to the send to your phone option. Uh, so before this option, before using this feature, make sure you are connected uh, or the PC on the lap, mobile phone are connected with the same email ID. Uh, so uh, if your device is connected, it will show you the device name on the top. Uh, you can send uh, the mobile location on both email and text so uh, now i'm uh, choosing the text option where it will send to your registered phone number from your google maps account so as you can see i just got the desired location or the location where uh, which i chose from my desktop pc so now i'm opening this uh, if you need to get the exact location on this uh, mobile phone just click the uh, HTTP link over here and it will take you to the, the location where you have uh, previously shared on from your PC you can now plot a route in Google Maps that goes to multiple locations to do so set up directions for your first location like you normally do and then tap the three vertical dots on the top right corner and choose add stop Add as many stops as you need and then tap finish.